Hello, Team Leo. This is your love tarot reading. I hope you're all well and safe. So we'll be getting into your energy, the person you are dealing with, and we'll pick up on intuitive messages for you and any advice spirit has for you, okay? Keep in mind these energies can go in reverse. So if you're cross-watching, okay, you could be on either side, okay? You'll know who's you. <laughs> Okay, Leo, um, I feel like you're expecting something, okay, or you're waiting for something. Let's see what's going on with you. What are the energies of Leo spirit? Okay. Wow. All right. Leo, what is going on at this time is that you're waiting for some type of, your focus is money, I feel, okay? I don't know if you've, you're taking a break from love, Leo, but your focus is money. By the way, it's me, guys. Um, my hair is up. I'm, um, I'm doing a hair mask, so <laughs> you don't see my long hair. It's because it's in a mask, okay? So you are building stability. So some of you could be waiting for like a contract to come in, like a work contract, a contract. Um, it could even be business for some of you. Okay. So I feel like you haven't heard from them yet, but it is coming. And Spirit is saying, okay, this is um, a contract that is coming in for you. Some of you are like, I haven't heard from them. You're waiting. Um, you could be like very antsy about it, Leo, but it is coming through, okay? So I don't see that your focus is love right now. Let's see. Huh. <clears throat> this is interesting, Leo. So you're tapping, I'm hearing... You're tapping into unknown ter ter territory. So this could be your shifting careers. Or it's like you need training for this new job. And some of you are anxious about it. But you know what? You're going to meet some really good people. Whatever this job is, you're going to learn a lot from this job. I feel like it's very promising. Okay? So let's see what's coming in for my Leo people. All right, so um, if you want a personal, that information is down below, Leo. I am open for personal readings. Also, if you like my vibe and my style of reading, don't forget to hit the bell and subscribe, okay? So let's see what is going on with my Leo people. What is coming in for my Leo's spirit? Ooh, okay. You know what I just heard? I know there's other cards coming out. This, whatever job this is, it's like this is going to lead you to a very powerful position. I'm just letting you all know. Remember this, that I said this. Empire333 said, Leo, you're going, even if you're just like entering it at a, like a, what is it called? Entry level position. Whatever job this is, is going to lead you into a powerful position. You're going to go higher and higher, okay? Keep in mind, it's going to take some time, but you are going to get there, okay? Ooh, so who is this? Leo? Oh, my God. Okay. So, Leo, there's someone new coming in. Okay, there is a new person coming in. Now, this could be someone you meet through work. Okay, and whoever this is, it's like you're fated to be with this. You're fated to meet this person. Okay, Spirit, can you tell me more about this person that Leo is entering Leo's life? Now, these readings are timeless, guys. So keep in mind that you could have already met this person, okay? But I'm, whoever this is, this is a newer person. This is not a past person you are connecting with. I think you already closed the door, Leo. <laughs> 
You know, I just heard that th that person was sneaking in and out of your life, and now you sneaked out of their life, Leo. Good for you. Okay, so this is a King of Wands, Aries Leo Sagittarius energy. It doesn't have to be an Aries Leo Sagittarius placement, okay? It could be their energy is just fire, okay? So this is someone who's like, they're an entrepreneur, they are like, they have masculine energy, okay? It doesn't have to be a man, all right? This is not gender, it's energy. Tell us more about this person, spirit. Ooh, I like this mix. Okay. King of Cups. So this is someone who is not only like, passionate okay but they're also they know how to deal with emotions right they don't like <clears throat> they're the type of person who is like they're comfortable in their emotions they don't mind being sweet to you leo okay i know you're gonna love this <clears throat> but leo you're going through a shift because in the past, you didn't value yourself, okay? Now you have more value for yourself, and this person is going to notice that, okay? This is really good. I love this energy. Claim it down below. <laughs> All right, let's see what's going on. What else can you tell us about this person, spirit? So this person is going to take their time to know you, Leo, okay? So in the past, it's like you attracted people that were just like rushing into your life. It's like before you knew it, you were in love. Like, what the heck? I'm in love. We're together. Or like they're rocking my world kind of thing. And that's why it's like you might have mistaken that for love, okay, is what I'm hearing. Um. Not that you didn't love the person, but I feel like some of you, you just love that intense passion energy and you love it when people pursue you, but that fizzles out, okay, Leo? And Spirit is saying here, this person, even though they're hot, um, hot, okay, they're hot, <laughs> all right, that just slipped out. Even though they're passionate, um, they have great masculine energy like they are very um straightforward they also have a um they're also like they know how to balance their emotions out too but spirit is saying here this is someone who's not going to be hot and heavy okay they're going to talk about like they're intense when they talk about life or when they talk about work okay um, they're passionate, but they might not show you that yet, okay? Because they might take their time. What about this person? What else do we need to know about this person? Okay. Wow. I really like this energy. Wow, we got the emperor on the bottom. Okay, Leo, I know that some people, you know, get involved in workplace stuff. I don't know if you're going to meet this person at work. Whoever they are, they have a big title, okay? There's, so there's someone who is well um, respected with whatever they do, okay? They could also be a dad, so they could have kids, but this person is very balanced in their approach, okay? But I want to let you know, even though I said this person's emotionally available, that doesn't mean they're going to be, um, they wear their heart on their sleeve, no, okay? This person's emotions run deep. They are not like that surface, bubbly, loving person. No, I don't see that, okay? They will take their time to get to know you. That's what I'm, I keep getting, Okay? So, um, ooh, 
Okay, yeah. See, they're gonna, Leo, this person, before they offer you something solid, okay, before they fully invest in you, they're gonna really get to know you. They're gonna inquire about you. It's not like they're gonna stop. I don't get stalking, but it's like they really want to get to know you in a deeper level, okay? They want to know, like, is Leo the type of person I can share a home with? Is Leo the type of person that's a great partner? Can we be great partners together? That's what I'm hearing. Okay. What else? We got a lot of signs here, guys. Uh, Sag, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Aries. We got a lot. Taurus. Did I say Taurus? Oh. Libra. Okay. Spirit, what else do you want us to know about this person? Knight of Cups. Yeah, wow. This is interesting. So this person, <clears throat> Leo, um, has somebody in the past that they were betrayed by okay they ended a connection um that they left so this person like i said they want someone to grow with okay they want someone that they know they can live with happily okay um i feel like this person when they come into your life they are so i'm hearing refreshing like they are refreshing to talk to you're gonna feel so good around this person okay it's like they have they're inspirational okay so it could be like they had a rough life and they talk about their life story and you're like just wowed um and this person um wow okay look at the bigger picture full moon and sagittarius okay um let's see what that's about prosperity lies ahead. Don't let your past hold you back. So guys, I'm getting, okay, Leo, if you've had money struggles for a long time, or you were just in your comfort zone, and you thought like, I'm never going to make better money, I'm never going to have that that better title. Maybe you think like the job that you're at done the job that you had before. It's like, no, prosperity is coming towards you. But um, I'm going to see what this means. What is this about? Don't let your past hold you back. South node. I just heard your roots, Leo. I don't know if there's some type of money issues with roots or so money patterns, maybe from your family that you have been conditioned, maybe like belief patterns that are holding you back. Don't, like, you have to incorporate new belief patterns. Yeah. Okay. And this also could be about, you know what I, what I just heard, Leo? So some of you have been in family situations, like, where, like, maybe your parents cheated on each other, and you think that that is normal. It's not. I mean how should I say this? Okay. I'm not trying to say it's abnormal. What I'm trying to say is that if you're, okay, if your mom stayed around with your dad because, you know, he cheated on her and she, she chose to suck by or vice versa, maybe your mom cheated on your dad and chose to suck by, um, okay, that's them. That doesn't mean that you're okay with that, okay? So what I'm hearing here is that you don't have to settle just because you think, I mean, you grew up to think that that's a normal dynamic or that's a healthy dynamic. 
every to each their own right but i feel like for you truly for your wish fulfillment if you're not getting your wishes fulfilled in a connection if you're going to feel like you're always the third wheel or you are not the chosen one um, and you lose sleep over it and it affects your health, okay? I'm getting a, a lot of you affects your health. Um, that means that that's not for you, okay? Or that person's not for you. And it's BS that people say all people cheat, all men cheat, all women, whatever it is, okay? It, that's not true, okay? I've dealt with so many people and clients throughout my life and that is not true, okay? And just people in general, it isn't. And trust me, I see the depths of people. I know. Okay? So this is about you creating change. There's major change in your life. You are releasing all the heavy baggage that you've been carrying. And you're starting fresh. And I love it. Okay? And, uh, yeah, you're moving on, Leo. Okay? So I'm going to see about this person, okay, what are their next moves? Like, let's see. Spirit, what's something that can stand out when they meet this person? I just heard they'll be heavily inspired. So this person is really going to inspire you in your life. Like they're going to be like um, a teacher for you. Okay, Leo, like you're going to look up to them. You're going to admire this person. Okay, what else, spirit? Ooh. Ha. You know what it feels like, Leo? It's like you... You're so used to someone... How should I say it? You're so used to someone that was in and out of your life. And... it Because they were so in and out of your life, you didn't really know them. But this person, it's like they're going to get to really know you on a deep level and you're going to really get to know them on a deep level. And I feel like this is a really high probability that you're going to have a long-term commitment with this person. Okay. This is like a long-term investment that is coming in. Okay. Let me see what else with these cards. Spirit, what else do you want to tell my Leo? Delight and adventure. This person is going to be fun, Leo. You're going to be on an adventure with them, okay? You're going to have fun. It's going to feel like you're young again. You bring out each other's inner child is what I'm hearing. Um, like you get out of your serious mode, Leo. Um, and delight, this is about Venus energy, okay? So this is Venus and this is your divine feminine energy. And I feel like this person is going to really, um, like, you're going to really be on your best game with this person. Because you're going to realize how in the past you were disrespected, okay? Um, I feel a very masculine energy coming towards you, but in a good way, not in like a, you know... I just heard, okay, not in a way that's like hit it and quit it, okay? I don't know if you had that that kind of person before. Sympathy. Okay. Innocence. See what I'm saying? It's like you're going to return back to your innocence, Hanayel. This is Angel Hanayel. You're going to return, okay, oh, this came out too. Okay, embrace Raphael. So really work on your heart energy, Leo, okay? And also, um, 
this person is going to really get to know the depths of you. And that's so important for you because then this person will understand you better and vice versa. You're going to get to know this person on a deeper level too. That's what I'm getting with this, okay? But it's going to start off slow. I'm just letting you know. It's going to start off slow, Leo. There's no point in rushing anything. Um, and this person is going to teach you how to receive, okay? Through this person, you're going to learn how to receive. You don't know how to receive, Leo. You're so used to giving in connections. That's why they're all in balance and that's why they're like up and down and you always feel like screwed over or you feel like the person is like, you're like, um, you feel like $2, okay? But this person is going to really help you. They're going to be your teacher, Leo. I'm just letting you know. You're going to learn really good um, relationship boundaries from this person. You're going to have fun. Like your inner child is going to come out to play, which is so important for you. This is great. Yeah. Claim this below. Claim this energy because it's a loving energy. I love it for you, Leo. I wish you all the best. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up. If you like this video, let me know how you resonated below and peace out.